Oh no. Okay, we need two vehicles. I only see one. We need the BMW right here, the i8, and then we need a Ford Raptor. Those are not paid off. All right, welcome back, guys, to another Special TV Repo Series video. And today I'm, I'm going to show it. Okay, we are on a totally different map this is the dlc guys this is the dlc map the platinum expansion map now this dlc came in a long time ago and i honestly i kind of now that fs17 is kind of wrapping up fs19 will be coming out soon i wish i would have played on this map more and i really don't know why i didn't it literally is made so well obviously it, like it's made by giants so there's no really like any errors whatsoever it's made by the game like producers so really cool stuff let's open up the store the store is kind of so there's the the shop whenever you buy something on this map it goes right here but one thing about the store is it's kind of levitating. We can kind of go underneath it. It's because the ground isn't flat. But it honestly doesn't really matter. We have a we have a palm tree in our store, which is awesome in our in our repo shop. So, which is really cool. And then of course the heli up top. There we go. Crack all the doors open. All we have today is the Kenworth and the Wrecker. The other ones are out being used by now by our workers. And here, let's turn our lights on. Boom. There we go. So. The plan is, we, we, guys, we're going to be repoing some big, big time guys around here. Some big billionaires. We're going to be repoing a b -b billionaire today. Pretty excited. And, uh, yeah, we don't have any, we don't have, like, any teammates or, um, workers. We're doing this solo. And another thing I need to do is we're going to go up here and we are going to... I want to recon the place first. So this place that we're going to, they, I, I'm pretty sure they don't have security guards. It's like this billion dollar mansion. And uh, we're going to go fly there and kind of scope some things out. And kind of on this channel, I'm sure you guys have seen this map a bunch of times. But on this channel, I've really never played too much on this map. And I really kind of want to, honestly, like myself, I know it hasn't been in videos. But even there's downtown i haven't even played on that much i'm pretty sure that road you can't get to the other side that's just the end of the map but the bridge does look really cool over there okay enough looking around oh what's that it's a soccer field there's not even grass Is, we're like i'm pretty sure it's like a mexican uh like mexico geography theme you know obviously southern there's palm trees and half of it is like dirt so probably not the best soil but okay so here it is boys so here is the place we should probably pick it up act like we're just flying over okay there's the billionaire's house oh my goodness he's got a pool everything okay there's the bmw i8 there's a chevy there's the okay i didn't see we're looking for another bmw and i'm pretty sure he's got a ford raptor let's swing around one more time guys this farmer owns all this land that you see that's why he's a billionaire he literally controls the market and uh yeah he makes a lot of money check this place out look at his look at his spot holy cow it looks like they have helicopter airplanes what else do they have oh my goodness bmw i8 oh my goodness big money all right so of course i didn't want to hover to oh no shoot through it shoot through it and okay turn around turn around we want to get out of these electrical wires oh my okay we're out of there perfect i didn't want to hover too close and i wanted to get in in and out of there because like obviously i don't want to like hover closely they know something's up for sure okay so with that it looks like the limo i don't know about you guys but i'm pretty sure i saw the limo doors were open so it looks like they might have been waiting for the owner Ooh, and you guys are probably wondering like he's a billionaire why why are we repoing his stuff if he has the money for it he he's just gone broke he's gone bankrupt and okay okay i'm trying to land this and talk at the same time come on he's gone bankrupt and all of his like from farming it kind of like messed him up so that's why we've got to repo him he's the known billionaire but because he's gone bankrupt he hasn't made it public but we can see through his records that it's time to go repossess his stuff he hasn't gone public with his bankruptcy like he's he's known around town obviously billionaire but now the banks are coming for him and they hire us so real quick let's throw our hazards on not our hazards our strobes i need to get that game volume up because now i can really oh there we go that's probably good much better decent honestly i can crank it up one more 
There we go. Okay, so what I'm doing, we got the Spectrum TV logo on the back. You just got licked. We're going to go like a billionaire, boys. We're going to go like a billionaire. I love this map. It's honestly, like, super nice. I love the, the theme. It's, like, older. It's much, much older. All the cars are, like, really old. It's kind of cool. And, yeah, great map. I wish I would have played on it more. Maybe we'll make more videos on it. But uh, we should have started a farm at this house. But, oh, well. No big deal. See, look at this little buggy. Like, what? And then... It, okay, that looks like a decently normal bus. Same with that Ford. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Convertible. Oh, nice. Oh, it's a little muddy. What the heck? Why would he take something like that off-road? Okay. So, our main goal, we need to pay attention here. I do see the limo. I don't want to pull in. I just want to scope it out. Okay, I'm worried. I see too, too much activity here. Could we see down this aisle? I, um. Okay, there's a limo right there, guys. You see that limo? It's kind of hard to see. Right by the pink tree, the limo is there. So that means he's probably getting picked up. What? I'm not sure. It's kind of like late, late morning, early afternoon. I'm not sure what could be going on. All right, let's get back on the road. I think we're going to have to wait this one out until we can go repo his house. Not his house, but his car, but at his house. Because you can see the caddy parked in the, in the like, super nice roundabout underneath the pink tree. He has a caddy for a limo. He, he has, like, his own limo service, all that. So let's wait for that bad boy to pass. And uh, we'll come back in a few hours and check up on him. All right, so it's 1230. It's a little past noon, so we should hopefully be gone for lunch. We've been looking, driving by uh, in between these. We came back one more time in between where we left off. He was still there. So we will see if he is still there and if the caddy moved. Let's find out. So there we go. Just to the right here, you're going to see his his driveway. All right. There's his little silo bins. Huge, huge farmer. Like, got passed down by the generations. Pretty sure he invested a bunch of his money. And now he's like a billionaire. A billionaire. Oh my goodness. Okay. This is kind of sketch. We're going down like a one way road here. If he comes around, he's going to see us. We got to get in here and get out. Okay. Yes. Limo's gone, but two cars are still here. Oh no. Okay. We need two vehicles. I only see one. We need the BMW right here, the i8, and then we need a Ford Raptor. Those are not paid off. Hopefully his limo driver knows that he the limo driver is gonna be at. Oh no! All right, we can't get up on there. Let's see. Does it got the keys? Oh yes, perfect. There we go. Straighten her out, and then let's get this down a little bit here. All right, let's see what we can do. Perfect. We got the front wheels up. Now let's just winch it up, and. There we go. Awesome. All right. Okay. There we go. Looks like it's good. Let's see if we can lock the load. All right. Perfect. I think. Oh, okay. This is sketchy. I wish I would have had one of my workers on here today, but we weren't able to guys. It's the weekend. Everybody was not working at, um, we had a few people working, but we all had to go separate. No big deal though. No big deal. Let's run this over here and let's check. Here, I'm gonna run to the shop real quick and then probably come back. That's not good though. Okay, a lot a lot of time's gonna pass here. Let, okay, let's see if we can get this Kenworth going. Come on, baby. Pick up some speed. I know the BMW I it weighs a lot. Honestly, no, it's probably like super light. It's probably like all carbon fiber body and everything besides probably like the frame. But alright. There we go. We're getting to up to 55. Let's shoot over here. And then drive back. I did not see the Ford Raptor. It's a red Ford Raptor 2018. Super nice. Those are like 100. I I don't want to say 100. I think they're like 80 grand. Like that is so expensive for a truck. Especially a truck that like doesn't really have too much utility in terms of like towing or actually getting jobs done. Which is kind of weird. Um, it's more of like a luxury truck. But anyway, there we go. Some, some people argue with that. But... To me, I see a Ford Raptor as just like a like a play truck. Like what you can do with a Ford Raptor, you can do with any other truck, but you're just paying more for obviously like more horsepower, but you guys know what I mean. Alright, there we go, perfect. 
Let's see if we can jump back into the Kenworth and then here run on the ramp one two psh, parkour Landed it awesome. All right. I love the palm tree I love the new addition to the special TV store guys. We're expanding. We're opening up new stores all the time new maps All right Repo and a billionaire. Let's get back on. I wish the I wish the Kenworth was a little quicker Okay, so here's what I was thinking on the drive back. I was like, you know what? Where could that Ford Raptor be and I did see a car garage a super nice garage all right, we got to pass this this slow guy. Is that the same guy with the mud on it? Yes, it is. What a nerd. Let's lay on the horn. All right, there we go. So here we are. We're at his almost like you call it like a plantation. I don't know where we are in terms of geography. I know we are in America, but there we go. Okay, I love how his random tree is just pink in there. I don't know. That thing is probably like super expensive. All right, crank it over. Oh, not too tight. All right, floor it, floor it, floor it. All right, boys, we've never repoed somebody this this rich in these nicer cars. Okay, let's see if we can figure this out. Where is the Ford? Okay, so there's the car garage. Hopefully, it's in there and it's not taken. All right, let's back this up. Mom, boy, see. All right, that should be good. Let's see if we can get this open. Oh, I almost hit the caddy. All right, come on. Come on. It's unlocked. Yes, let's go. Okay, we should be able to unlock it from in here now that we're in. There we go. Awesome. Oh my goodness, what a bunch of nerds. They left the door unlocked. Perfect. Here's the Ford Raptor. There we are. Oh, we don't want to get in that. There we go. Lower it down. Oh no, we're taking off. Boys, we're taking off. Okay. The Ford Raptor, the F-150 Ford Raptor. This thing looks like a beast. All right, we're taking off here. We gotta lay the horn on them. Let them know they just got licked. Best Spencer TV. That is the only two vehicles we need to take. So that's good. We don't have to come back. And it's like 12:42. So we've we that probably took us what? It took us like 10 minutes, a little less than 10 minutes. And typically people leave for lunch like at 12. I don't know exactly when he left. You could have left just the second before we got there. Uh, but yeah. Okay. Perfect. If he comes back, he's going to see his garage. He's going to think somebody's stolen, but we always throw, obviously, we, we throw that you just got repossessed by Spectre TV. And any questions, you can talk to the bank or come to our come to our office to come claim your car. If you do pay it off and all the fees that come with it, the fees are the bad part. Like, if you just paid it, paid for it there, and they got to pay it, yeah. There's just a lot of fees that come with this stuff. So, if he if he gets out of his, his whole debt, thing that he's in he lost all his money then that will be uh then he should be able to buy these back just fine but we will see all right let's unload this bad cat drop her off like right here all right perfect there we go let's drive this right back down here boys that ford raptor looks clean i don't think i would buy one personally uh just because like i said the utility you're paying so much more i would rather just get like um I'd rather just get like, you know, like a 3500 diesel rather than, you know, an F-150 just because they're the same price. Like you get a super nice, super nice 3500 diesel, you know, like duly on it for like an actual like getting jobs done for the price of that. So that's kind of how I feel about that. But honestly, go for it. If you guys like Ford Raptors, like I'm not going to diss it. It's just not my, not my giddy up and go. All right, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna head down here I, I, and we're gonna go into town. We do have, we have one more repo. We have one more repo and it is a Porsche 911. It's like baby blue. And we're gonna see if we can get that on the back of our back of our truck and see if we can get that in there. It's it's like this, this business owners. I don't know if his business has gone out of business that he can't pay for it, but the, you, you guys will see. It's like this, by the spinnery, the spinnery in town here. All right, crank her over, boys. Crank it. All right, first person view. Keep it real. All right, watch it. Oh, oh. The left and right in first person is opposite. So if I want to go left, I go right. A little weird. All right. We'll look both ways. One, T. Crank her over. Come on, Bessie. All right, there we go. Ooh, there's a Bugatti. Oh, my goodness. Well, we aren't looking for a Bugatti, but there are a lot of rich people around here super nice stuff okay is that the porsche it's kind of the same color as the bugatti all right there's the porsche 
What did he do? Did he do like a burnout getting in here? What the heck? Why is there like tire? I don't know. That's weird. All right. Well, no more burnouts for this guy. Let's see if we can hook up on here. Come on. Just right. All right. Perfect. Let's jump in it. And then throw it up on here. Oh my goodness, Porsche 911, boys. I don't know. Ooh, Porsche 911. That is... Ah, oh, it's such a nice car. Such a nice car. All right, let's straighten this up. Just the hair. We got to walk her back. One wheel... Two wheel rotations, and we should be good. There we are. All right, so that's like some business office right there. And that was his Porsche, so... There we are. We're leaving town. But yeah, there's a Bugatti right here. Good thing we'd have to repossess that if I mess that up. Two and a half million dollars for that bad boy. Oh my goodness, there's some big money around here, boys. All right. I don't know. Is this baby blue? I feel like this is more ocean blue. You know? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. All right, crank it over again. There's a little buggy. I love those. Uh, which way are we going? We're still getting used to the map. Hang a left. Should have known that. You can't go over there. But that bridge is super cool. You can't go on it. But I mean, it's just it looks really nice. All right, boys. There we are. Oh, took off cruise control. My bad, my bad. So let's head up to the shop. And that, like I said, is the last few people. There's a shop right there. And uh, we got to park these, put these away, up, um, put our tow, tow truck away. But that is pretty much it for today's video. If you guys do and did enjoy the video, please smash the like button. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do that as well. It helps the channel. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, for just being here. If you watch till the end, I just want to say thank you very much. And uh, you guys are the best all you guys who watched till the end and this kind of i always say thank you at the end because it's more of my loyal viewers who watch at the end so thank you thank you and i will see you all in the comment section bye